Jordan, can you talk about getting banged up in the first half and then just trying to work through it and get back out there? Um, just a part of football. Um, I'll do whatever I can for this football team. Uh, so every time I can be out on the football field, I'm going to be out there. Um, yeah, we fought hard. Got to get better, fix, fix those little mistakes that we had. Um, it sucks. Losing sucks. Um, but this offseason, we will get better, and we'll be better. We will be a better team next year. When, when you try to go back in, but then have it come out, was it pain or just lose strength in it? Or? I got hit on it. Um, once again, just part of ball. Um, went out. Trainers got me right. Um, they're great. Appreciate them. Um, yes, sir. Did you feel okay physically in the second half? Like, was that impacting your ability to throw at all or anything like that? Um, no, sir. I felt good. Once, once the adrenaline gets going, uh, I feel pretty good. The offensive line did a great job today. Just fighting. Um, receivers made some big plays. Um, I can't do anything without my guys. So, I mean, I appreciate them. So if you guys are down 17 in fourth quarter, you get it back to where it's, it could go really way at the end. Is that, do you take any satisfaction in that, or is it just, just disappointment? Um, it's disappointment. Um, losing sucks, once again. Um, I mean, that's, that's just, <laughs> it's just our year, how our year went. We had a lot of ups and downs. Um, didn't start the game off strong, but, man, we fought. Uh, this is a team that fights hard for the guy next to him, and it's really impressive to see. Um, we haven't been like this in, ever since I've been at Florida State. So just seeing the team grow together, just getting better every single day, and we're going to keep working. I know your belief in the coaching staff and your teammates and all that, but with the, the results of I mean, winning five of the last eight, how you talked about it, how just feeling was about the momentum of the program entering the offseason? Uh, we're in a good, we're, we're taking the right step, man. I feel like, I mean, this is a family. Uh, I've never been so sad after a game in my life. Um, just seeing those guys, my brothers, I'm um, upset their last college football game. Um, it sucks, man, but we're gonna keep growing. We're gonna keep getting better. Um, that's all it is, man. We've got to keep a positive mindset, stick together, and work really hard this offseason. Jordan, what, what, if anything, did you learn about yourself as a quarterback that maybe you didn't even know back, say, August 20th or August 30th? And you know now. Uh, I know I'm a pretty good quarterback. Uh, I can throw the ball pretty good. Um, yeah, man, I worked really hard. Coaching staff did a great job with me just instilling confidence in me every single day. I go out there and work really hard. Yeah, man, and I started to become a leader today. I got the guys together. It was my first time in a while. I just know I'm taking that next step of becoming that leader that I need to be, speak a little bit more. Um, yeah, man, I'm growing. Can you talk about, uh, I'm not sure what you could take what you took outside the field, criticism of that. How did that help you in terms of your Honestly, it got to me a lot. It did get to me at the beginning of the year. Uh, I struggled. Um, but at the end of the day, I have one of the greatest supporting cast uh, and everything I could dream of in a family, in my friends, um, just supporting me. I, I never had went one second without the day just being upset without having someone text me. My brother was always on, on my phone calling me, my dad, my brother, um, my mom. Um, yeah, man, I just had a great supporting cast, a team, Coach Dillingham, every single day he would talk, we'd have a talk after practice. And I just have a great supporting cast, and I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world. I'm very blessed. When, when did you get the guys together? Was it you were down? I'm pretty sure it was we were down 10 or 17. As you, you may not be thinking about it yet, but I guess, do you have any personal goals for the offseason, things you want to work on? Yeah, I have a lot to work on. Uh, I'm going to come back next year. Is there, I'm going to be ready next year. Is there, any specifics or just? Everything. Any? All around quarterback. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I didn't think I did a great job. Um, once again, there's always room for improvement. Got to keep growing every single day as a person, as a player. I think I'm doing a good job, man, but there's always room for improvement. I just got to keep growing. What did, what did Jermaine here, those, those guys that came in for this one year, what did they, what did they do to help to do this program? I meant every, everything to this program. They're the heart and soul of our football team. The D line this year, they really held their own, man. It keeps us going. Um, yeah, they're the heart and soul of this team. They're a bunch of leaders. They led by example. Um, and they always have your back, man. They're special players. Um, and we are very blessed to have them here. I'm very thankful for all of them. Let's go, two more. You guys, you know, coming up so close, this game, the Clemson game, their losses, but what do you think that does for you guys confidence-wise going into the season? Once again, losing, it's all about losing. I think losing, that just no matter how close it is, I think 
close games hurt us a little bit more, honestly. Um, yeah, they suck. But yeah, man, we're getting better. We're, we're growing in every aspect. You see guys flying all over the field. We're conditioned. Uh, Coach Norvell, Coach Storms, all of them work us really hard in the off season. Yeah, man, but the sky's the limit for this football team. We have special people everywhere, and we're going to keep growing. You guys have a lot of the core guys coming back. How different will this offseason be with what you've learned about each other this year? I think I just told them all, I was telling them all, uh, telling each one, I love you and I appreciate you. Um, but this offseason, we're going to work. We know how it feels to win football games again. And we know how it, how it feels to lose, too, man. And we don't want this feeling ever again. So I promise you, this offseason, we're going to work really hard.